Good morning, everyone. Um, as most of you know, or the few of you know, <laughs> I am a new YouTuber now. So I need to do a solo video as well. There is plenty of time in the future to do a, plenty of videos, but I kind of just wanted to do first thing, um, first battle this morning. I, ju I just now got on for the first time today, so I'm hoping that maybe this will be a good battle. A lot of times it's either, it can go either way for me. I can wake up, uh, you know, my first battle today could be ugly as shit or it could be good as gold. So let's see what happens. Yeah, I'm into, well, I won't get to show off much of my beacon game that I have, which I do have a pretty good one for the size of my box, but I can still try to make a good one, and hopefully this lag will catch up. I'm starting off with my uh, aphids here. Because I love to blast them over the ramp on this map. And smacked in the face. Not too bad though. Must not be leveled up that much. A lot of times on here, it'll it'll look as if your aphids hit the ramp, going towards them, um, and but it actually hits them. So, and it seems like you get all the power off of them, which you're supposed to. So, all right, this may be a boring match because a lot of people are just long distance shooters now since the last update. But we shall see. I mean, I'm one of those people, right, you know, especially at the beginning of a match that, you know, if you got three beacons, you just defend them. There's really no reason to advance straight out the gate. I mean, you don't know what the enemies have. You want to preserve your bots. Blase, blase. So just holding three beacons is awesome. You know, and then if I have to sit here, like, and almost fall asleep, then I'm probably gonna wind up going forward if nobody comes towards me. I don't know, you know, just the, seeing those guys up there like that makes me think that they're froze, <laughs> you know, but they're, they're not froze, they're just freaking camping. But you know, it's uh, an easy win, you know, and I'll take it, whatever. That's what I'm out for is wins, you know. Um, I like to get high damage. I like to get numerous beacons, things of that nature. But, you know, an easy win now and, now and again isn't bad either because freaking some of these, some matches be ridiculously hard and ridiculously sad losses. <laughs> so an easy win is just like, all right. You know, so... They'll start feeling the pressure of nobody advancing and then they'll start to probably come up here. I had my nose hanging out over the edge and so we took advantage of that, but you know, they're gonna have to do a little bit more than that if they wanna win the match.
he's dying to hit somebody with his tumblers and pins. It's freaking hilarious. Why don't he come on up and brawl? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> See that the ape it looked like they hit the ramp there, but they took a little chunk out of him. I mean, it's starting to get to the point oh, now. I mean, it's like four minutes, over four minutes into the match. The guys have not advanced. The beacon bar is getting crazy, you know. And I, I know that at matches, people could come back at the very end. But, you know, if they don't start doing something soon, they're not going to even gonna be able to come back at all. But see how boring this is with the... With the I mean, I don't know if I should make this a special video about how the uh, the little update with the everybody's uh, you know got their R R R D B griffs or whatever you know the tumblers and pin griffs and all that stuff out. It's just <laughs> it's so funny how you know five of the reds will all bring it out at the same time and then. And then you got your couple of reg, you know, somebody up there shooting hydras. You got your uh, Christmas tree butch and things of that nature. You know, trident, trident shooter here and there. They're not doing anything. Um, it makes for a very boring match. But it makes also makes for a win for me, you know. I'll get my plus league points in an easy manner, you know. So whatever. Enough about that. I mean, uh, I'm sure everybody, most people that's played this game long enough know what I'm talking about. Um, others, you can see, you can see right here in this video. Uh, right, if it's misting right there. Uh, okay, it looks like. Uh, did their trip guy might have left the match and all that stuff. See, now it's time, you know, I may have could have went forward a little earlier, but it's time to go in and try to get whatever little damage I can get before it's over. Um, at least so I could try to rank somewhat. Um, I'll still get my plus league points. But not like as if I was first. I don't. I know I probably won't get first, second, or third place. But I could try to squeeze that in here at the end. Let him take me out there. You know, big my easiest chance will be pulling out the uh, my longest range, so I can try to get up in there and get one shot off before it's over. But it's, it's so funny, sniper heaven didn't do it. I mean just long distance fights do don't don't do them any justice on this map when the whole team is all long range. They should have destroyed or something, you know what I'm saying? It's freaking It's freaking hilarious. kinda of funny to me really. Didn't even get that shot off, but, you know. And, and then at the end, they really start feeling the pressure. And they're gonna start advancing in, and get whatever little damage they can get, because they're gonna try to get first or second place for those influence points, or I mean, uh, league points or whatever. But at any rate, sorry, the my first match of the day was so boring. Maybe yesterday's one. I'll start posting. I'll start doing my first match of the day every day. And just putting it on there because I'm kind of digging this YouTube stuff. I did rank, uh, I did get third place, so a little extra league points. Got the seven on that, so anyways, hope everybody has a good day. And oh, yeah, please don't be one of those campers, <laughs> you're making the game boring. <laughs>